Hi Aries, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 10th until 16th. Oops, okay. Huh. You are wondering about your life and you're wondering about the directions that you really want to take your life to. Or you're actually wondering where is life taking you at this moment. Now let's take a look Aries. What's going to be coming your way this week? And I haven't really updated my website because I've been really busy lately, but I'm already working in the update, okay? I know that a lot of you are, are checking out on your telescope. So, well, thank you for visiting my website. All right. Ooh. Aries. Looks like someone's going to be making an excuse and escaping your... Well, either your domestic environment or uh, someone is just tr gonna try and uh, come up with an alibi that they are going away well another fire sign is actually lying in front of you so be very careful about that and this is somebody that no oh. so you're also gonna be receiving a visitor this week okay now Okay, Aries. Um, first off, you'll be traveling within the next two days, two weeks, and two months. I feel like it will be around Tuesday or Thursday. And if not, then it will be the second week or the, you know, within the next two months. Some of you are trying to free yourself off from a very toxic relationship, especially if you're with an earth sign or with a fire sign. Okay? Now... You know that right from the very beginning, there are a lot of red flags and there are a lot of lies and alibis that you've already caught your, your partner, you know, about the things that you're claiming, which is, you know, well, they're not even aware that you're already aware that whatever that they are telling you are, are purely lies and, uh, you know, not really true. But then this week, your intuition will start kicking more and more. And most of the things that you will be like delving into, situation, places, people that you'll be talking to, you will be guided to their direction or you will be guided to, you know, to come their way or to hurl in that particular place or vault or whatever it is because you will be uncovering more lies, you know, that are, I feel like, Sometimes you're just you're gonna have some goosebumps, or you're gonna have, you're gonna, you you will feel so awful about yourself that how could you really put up with, you know, with all of this lies all this time and all these years, and you're just gonna be, you know, like you will feel more um, horrible, okay, or depressed about the things that you will be going through or about the things that you will be facing this week. Now. There are some legal battles or there are some, you know, um, legal talks or discussions that you're planning or even filing. Some of you will be, you know, decided to really file for the divorce and some of you will be filing for, um, you know, um, for some child custody or restraining order or something like that. But whatever it is, it's like this week, it will really give you the nudge or it will really give you the... Um, you know that uh, that inkling feeling that enough is enough, and you can, you know, like you just can't really put up with all of this bullshit. And y y you know, the show is it's just done. It's over. You know, you you can't really play along with it anymore. Now, there is a water sign that will be reaching out to you, or that will be communicating with you, and this will be more of an additional info about the things that you really want to know about your partner. <coughs> now. A part of you feels a little bit scared, okay, to start all over again. And a part of you feels like it's really time, okay? Now, you will somehow think of another person that lives far from you. I feel like this is more of a, uh, like a child or a son that is also another fire sign that will also be coming your way to your aid. Now... You don't want to let this person know what is really going on. But then somebody from the past will be re-emerging or will be, you know, coming out of the blue and to the rescue, which is an older air sign. And I feel like you've been thinking about this person for quite some time already. 
Now, you feel like you don't even know why your life is rolling down like this you know that you'll have a lot of questions this is also the week where you will be feeling a little bit down depressed and um, feeling a little bit you know aloof from other people your family and friends will be getting in touch with you and will be asking you like how you've been doing how you are and stuff like that but you know you're just going to mask your feelings and you'll just tell them that you're okay even though you're not now you will try to battle this yourself and i feel like by the end of the week you will decide to talk to this air sign because you're it's like you're already running out of air to breathe and you just needed somebody to talk to or to vent out with and you'll be very happy with your decision because you know it's like you are dumping something heavy inside your chest and you'll be feeling even more better and you can breathe more and you will have more clarity of mind and direction as to where your life is going and where or which direction should you choose. Okay, so this is the week that you will be making that major decision of taking the next step to another and leaving something behind it's not yet the end of it because i did not get the uh, the death card anyway it's not that it's not yet the end of everything but it's like you will be willing out the changes that you really want to see in your life that you've been waiting for for a long period of time and this is the moment of truth and this is also the moment of brevity okay which is you should have done this a few months ago you know when this first occurred in the month of october or september Oh, August, September, October, something like that. And I feel like, you know, this f fire sign that you're with right now, expect that you will have a hard time cutting this person off. I don't feel like it's going to be very easy for you to just discard them and leave them behind because there are still some you know some strings and some stuff that is um that the, the two of you are connecting and um it's like now that you're really ready to open the door walk out of the door you still feel a little bit you know uneasy or uncomfortable or unsure because it's like there's like a metal ball that's been uh, dragging you or that you've been dragging from your behind and that is the one that's making your journey a little bit more heavier or difficult but anyway you will be freeing yourself up and if you are planning to look for a new job someplace else or if you're worried about your job you don't really have to worry because this you know this week you'll be safe and whatever decision that you'll be making from this week onwards you will be safe and you will be guided but Aside from this, you know, major decision that you will be doing and that you will be making, changing of job, um, if you don't have any other offer, if you don't have any other opportunity that's already, you know, like um, standing outside, then don't make any major move, okay? Because your job will be safe, okay? You don't really have to worry about getting laid off or getting fired or getting stuff like that because... You know, your management likes your performance, but if it's only because of your personal things or personal ordeals, why you want to leave that place that you're in right now, um, wait until first week of April, okay? And for those who will be moving into a new place or a new house, um, It is much better for you to move around the 12th or the tw or the 22nd of this month. All right. So anyway, that's it for you for this week, Aries. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.